Welcome to the Overwater Spa Villas at the Conrad Rangali Island in the Maldives. This is number 418, which is out near the end. Not the farthest out, but boy, close enough. It's a large room. Opening up with a sitting area and a pretty impressive view down the way of your neighbors. You can see they say these are up to 500 meters out to sea and this one is pretty close. So the seating area, if you choose to have a seat there, the daily fruit today, apples, the supply is replenished every morning. Little desk area there, closet with some beverages and whatnot. There's a television, we'll get to the view in a minute. Here's the bed. What's interesting about the bed is that on both sides there are views outward to a small cubby hole that dips down right into the water. There's a glass railing that does not allow you to go past it. Though you can open the doors, that's what this handle is for. So you can have the splashing of the waves down below while you're sleeping. Alright, so there's the view out the window. Get a little closer so that expose your balances properly. And there it is, your view of the Indian Ocean and a jacuzzi, the brand name jacuzzi out there perched above the shallow waters. All right, so there's your 42 inch 1080 TV. Oh, also a Blu-ray player down there. What's interesting is that it's not hooked up with HDMI, so it's not going to be true HD out. It's RCA, just uh, video audio. This is the bathroom. You can see twin sinks, metal, and then down below, when you bend over, you can see the water, what amounts to a small amount of glass floor. An impressive bathroom with lots of space. Over to the right, looking back toward the bed, there are twin closets, one which is a wardrobe and one with shelving. Over here, a pair of kimonos, or robes, actually both, the kimono in the front and the robe in the back. On this side of the room, you'll find the toilet, as well as a small sink, soap, and towels. Out that window, is a walkway to your private spa treatment area. Take you there. It's open. It doesn't have to be unlocked by someone who's performing a spa treatment. We're outside. Now we're looking at the glass back toward the sinks, the basins. And inside the spa treatment room you'll find two treatment tables as well as, as, well as another sink impressive views. The door on the left opens if you wish to have the air flowing in. A couch off to the right, a sofa. And then opposite the windows you'll find exercise equipment so that you don't have to make the fairly lengthy journey over to this, the gym to get some exercise in. They've got some weights there as well as a medicine ball and then one of these big bouncing balls. So back to the room. Two more things to show you in the room. Pretty cool view there of the of the neighbors. Here we are back in the room. The shower and the bath are next. The shower is off to our right just as soon as we enter this room. You'll see it's tiled. all the way up. Rain shower. And then the tub has a wonderful, wonderful view out the windows. It also is set up such that there's a bench on the leading edge. That's it right there. So this is your step with your toiletries. So there's a, a bench and then the depth of the tub. So you can literally sit inside the tub 
and look out the window with panoramic views of about 270 degrees. And again, being so far out, your view is fairly well unobstructed with the exception of the fence on the left side of this particular unit. Okay, now to go outside. This door is locked. And here's the veranda. Two lounge chairs, as well as, ah, uh, just taken by the view, as well as an umbrella. Also two sitting chairs and a small table. Perfect for a little bite to eat out here. There's also, I guess it could be a, a treatment table, or a place just to lie down. And then there's your jacuzzi. And then there's Nicole. And the steps down to the Indian Ocean. And your home for nine nights.